actually it was Deepak Chopra who speaks about how can we grow happily into maturity or old age, happy and healthy. He had two common denominators. He says, if you somehow through the act of grace or through some coincidence open into this infinite presence, this boundless, vast presence that is a peace that is beyond words, or this stillness, this love and presence, and by doing so, clear out memories that are held in ourselves, that is key. That is the key. But how? How do you do that? Not because I felt like I needed it, but I was setting out to work as a homeopath, so I wanted it for my clients at that time. And so this is what I heard from Deepak Chopra. And I tried my hardest to follow all the instructions that he gave at that time. And I'm talking about mid-90s. And I wasn't very successful. But it was then, I think, a couple of years later that I came across Brandon and her work. And she actually says that on day one of my workshop, you experience this infinite presence, this infinite intelligence, I call it source. And on day two, you learn a process that helps you uncover traumatic cell memories. We clear them completely. And I thought, if this woman is right, then she's holding the key to health, youth, youthfulness, happiness, everything. And I couldn't believe that it could be that simple, but somehow I made it to her workshop and this is actually one where my journey began because my thinking my arrogance of i need this for my clients or i need this for my patients as a homeopath i realized how much work there was to do on myself but yet on this very first weekend there was a huge massive waking up happening it was like somebody turned the lights on the inside and life has never been the same again from that first day. Not even the complete weekend, the first day turned everything. And I knew that what Deepak Chopra said then was true. He just didn't have the tools, and yet there was somebody who has the tools. And I have been using this work for myself in my personal family as best as possible. And it really has made a profound shift in all of our lives. And I have seen it over and over and over in so many people that I have met on my travels.